Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This should be the last of the collection of Miniverse Lifestyle Home. I just need the hanging pathos, I think is how you say it. I weighed it, it weighs exactly 76 grams and I could feel the little circle on top for the hook. So let's open it and see. And, ooh, it is. This is the last one I need, so I'm so excited. A lot of times you could find um, pictures on Reddit that have the weights of the series and pretty accurate. There's the pot. It's plastic, has a really cool design on it. I'm dreading having to tie the fancy little knot for this one because it is a hanging plant. There's a rubber band around this. I'm using the difficult way of taking this off. Come on. There we go. Okay, that was a struggle. Here's what the plant looks like. It's very loosey-goosey because it's supposed to hang down like that. I don't know how on earth that's going to stick without resin. But I always put resin on mine. These are the little stands and the shovel. We got some checklists in there. Need some potting soil. And then... Oh, the string, the dreaded string to tie it with. Here's the checklist. And they don't really show you how to tie it. Maybe it's just me, I suck at tying things. Um, they just show what it's supposed to look like. So you're supposed, it's supposed to go around it too, which I wasn't expecting. I thought we were just tying the loops together, but then it also goes around it and ties there and ties there. What? doesn't show you how to do it and I'm also not sure there's enough string maybe there is but yeah it's like is this supposed to be one continuous piece are you supposed to cut it so it's even and then you loop them through I need I need more instructions than that so let's see I wish they would have just already did this part or did pieces of it. I just kind of assumed it was going to look like that. And then you cut it and then do it again. I don't know. I guess I'm going to mess with this for a while. And see. But that also seems like really messy too. Hmm. <laughs> I'm going to mess with it and I'll be back to show you what I decide. Okay, I had to do that off camera because that was kind of awful. <laughs> and then when you let go of that tension, then it looks all like floppy. I wish they would have used like what looked like rope, but was more rubbery and kind of stiff. And then you just like hooked it through. Anyways, so to kind of explain how to do it, think of it as a triangle. So I started here, went through this loop, went over, went up here, held it went back down that same one, went around this one, and up that one. So you're making little triangles. And then when I got to the top, um, I kind of, there's a couple loops and one that was like just sticking up the end of it. So I stuck this through the loops and tried to kind of like tie it, even though I wasn't sure that that was going to stay put. It went around it. I did put the smallest dot of resin right here and cured it, thinking that it won't come unraveled. So I should be able to just cut that. And we have a loop of sorts. And if you hold tension on it and kind of make them tight again, then it looks pretty okay. Hopefully I explained that well enough. But again, think of it as a triangle. And each rope goes through the little handle twice. Goes one way and then goes the other. All right. Now that that is complete, let's add some dirt in here. This is the potting mix that looks cool. It has like little white specks in it. And it's a pretty deep plant. I bet we're gonna use most, if not all of it. Try to get it in all the little corners there. Yeah. And then I'll make a little hole in the center. Then I'll add resin to make sure it all stays put. I 
feel like I could use even more. That compacts down pretty good. I have a small bit in my hand that I'll probably save to cover up the root. Um, but make a little indent in the center. Spin it around, dig out a hole. Put that in there. Yeah, I think that'll be good. And then I could cure that. And then what's left here, um, I could use it to cover the root or I could just stick it back here. It is a little uneven. I'll put a bunch of resin in the hole and cure it, but then I'll probably smooth some around top of the dirt in here. That way that doesn't ever fall out either. But that should be good. I have some leftover resin here. I'm not sure how much there is in here, but I'm just gonna try to squeeze out what's left and then I'll go get another bottle as well. I put a lot in there. Went ahead and just put it all over. Let it sit for a minute so it could kind of roll and go where it needs to go. It will look wet in there when it dries, but I don't care because it's a plant. Plants are supposed to have water and be watered, so I think that's fine. Let's go ahead, put this in the very center, and I will hold it while I cure it. Okay, it is hard as a rock. I don't think it's going to come out. So let's put these back up. <laughs> it is a little top heavy because it's all leaning on one side, but um, that's how it's supposed to look. I wonder if you can separate, oh it is in two pieces. I wonder if you could put one through one side and one through the other. That might help balance it so it doesn't lean so much. Let me see. I think they're a little intertwined. See so if we leave one that way, bring this one out through this side. I guess it's still going to lean because it won't be equal, but it might look better. Let's see. That leaf is stuck. Now that leaf is stuck. Well, that's cute. They could have did a third one and had it coming out this other side. That way when you hang it, it doesn't all lean in one direction. Or you could maybe try to even it out like that. I don't know. What do you guys think? I think it was hard to tie, but it didn't turn out half as bad as I was envisioning. But um, kind of cute. I think it's too big to hang in here because I made... Yeah, too big. I made the loop um, kind of long. There was enough string to do that, had about three inches of string left over. So that is what I have. If you guys want to see the other series or other items in this series, make sure to check out my channel. Lots of videos posted. Thanks so much for watching. Bye guys.